What's happening, Panda Nation? Peter Ron Panda. If you want to check out dummy iPhones, you've come to the right place. So I showed you a couple of my dummy fake iPhone. These are the 11s here, and you can see I got them in black and white. Uh, showed you these, and I kind of like them, but one of the things that I wanted to do was get some in different colors and sizes to see what they look like. So pick this one up, and this is obviously the red one, a very desirable color from you know, Project Red. Apple stuff, whenever they come in red, seems to sell pretty well. We do have like the glass back. That looks pretty good. Um, this bumper here is painted red. That all looks pretty good. You know, even the holes in the lightning port look pretty realistic. The button actually works, although it's pretty loose in there. Even they have little simulated bands. This is where the, the kind of the fakes show a little bit is this separate floating piece here for the camera housing um doesn't look quite as good as a real one now this one obviously is supposed to be the 11 versus the pro which the, would have the three cameras working buttons on the side working mute switch kind of it just flops around and then we have a simulated screen oh a software update which is just paper printed behind this clear plastic i assume so uh, this is the 11 and you can see, I think it's like a 6.5 inch and a 6.2. I think that's how they classify them. And then this one, as you can see simulated screen on it as well. But this one is the white one and this would be the Pro uh, in the smallest size. So this is the Pro, not the Pro Max. And this is a white one. Let's take a look at this white one. I can tell you that this is a little bit more you know, it, it's on the camera, it kind of looks a little more yellowed. In person, it doesn't really look yellowed as much as the glass looks just slightly tinted. This definitely has a clearer white, but if you were to look at this alone, it, I don't know, maybe it has a slight ivory tinge, but you can see here the size difference between these two, Pro and Pro Max. So I think this is a five and a half inch screen, technically. You can see just a little slop. I mean, uh, this doesn't even work there, but these buttons press. Chrome strip, we've got the little separators in there. You can see the camera housing is uh, pretty good. I mean, I'm sure it's about the same size. And then all the holes down here, and this is actually a little more accurate with the, the fewer holes there. So if you wanted to pick up basically dummy iPhones in any flavor, you could certainly do that. And these weren't that expensive. And I will say the dummy iPhones are like 10 bucks usually everywhere else. I'm not sure if it's people need these for displays or what, but I think I paid like 50 bucks a piece for these things. So right now they're probably more expensive than they need to be. But just wanted to show you what the dummy phones look like, especially in the smaller form factors there. They're even copying that Project Red logo on the back of this one. So uh, I'll put a link to them in the description if you want to pick them up. Peter Von Panda, out.